The reason that I titled this video Working with Winners is because I think one of the biggest mistakes that people in networking make is spending their time with the wrong people. And so what I just want to share with you today is what I've learned over my years of networking is you want to spend time with the people who have several qualities and the best way, the best time to find out when they have these qualities or not is right at the outset at the interviewing and qualification process that you do right at, at the beginning and up front. Um, the first absolute thing that I look for is their desire, their determination, and their why. Um, I basically have a conversation with them about why they want to be in business and why they would want to, you know, set out for themselves, create an additional stream of income. You know, what's going to be that burning desire that'll take them through the hard days, that'll wake them up and help them to execute their plan consistently every day. Um, pretty much everything in life boils down to how badly you want it. So I will take will over skill any day of the week. I prefer to work with people who have a big reason and a big drive as opposed to big talent because you can have an incredible amount of talent and if you don't have the desire to channel it in a certain direction, it's really not going to go very far and it really doesn't amount to much. So the very first thing that I look for is determination and desire. Secondly, one of the really important things that I look for in people is whether or not they're ready to learn something new. Are they into improving themselves? Are they into self-development? Are they willing to um, be taught? Because if they have never been in networking before especially, it's really important that they're going to be willing to listen to what you say and follow the plan because when you're working with a lot of people, we have a very large group, we don't have time to custom make um, you know, some kind of special plan to accommodate each individual person and how they feel like they should be doing their business. So I won't waste time with somebody who's not willing to really be taught. Um, there are people ahead of us in this industry who have absolutely learned what works and what doesn't and I don't want someone to come into my business wanting to reinvent the wheel. Um, if they want to do that, that's certainly fine and you know I have no problem with them joining the business, just I'm not going to spend my personal time working with someone who cannot um, follow someone else's leadership, someone who's already been there, someone who's already done it. Um, so don't waste your time with people who are not teachable. It's an incredibly frustrating thing. I made that mistake in the past and I never make that now. I won't work with anybody who's not willing to be taught. The last thing that I really look for is discipline and commitment. Um, they need to be committed at least to a year to two years to work the business to see the fruits of their labors. Most things take time to develop. Uh, my husband and I have been in business for 17 years and we've never started a venture that was successful within three months. Um, except for actually our networking business, but that was only be because we had already paid our dues in the business community. So that's a little bit different and I think that whenever somebody um, does not have that commitment to stick it out and to really execute a plan day after day after day after day and still be in the game two years down the road, then I don't want to waste my time with them because I'm going to spend all this time, all the hard part is on the front end when you're um, getting someone trained and teaching them you know, how to really work their business and if you put all that time and effort in you know, as a sponsor or as an enroller and then they quit, you've invested the most precious thing that you have, which is your time. You could have been spending it with somebody who would still be in the business utilizing what you taught two years from now. So don't waste your time with people who do not have a big drive to do it. Never convince anyone into this business. If you have to convince them to join your business, you will definitely have to convince them to work the business and they will be more of a drain on your time and energy than it's worth it. Never work with somebody who won't be led or taught. You need somebody who believes in uh, self-improvement and self-development so that they can develop the skill set that they need. And definitely never work with somebody who lacks a long-term commitment. Those are the three biggest things that I look for when I want to work with somebody. And I hope that this 
is some good valuable information for you I would love to hear from you please visit my MySpace page and read our story it's myspace.com forward slash creating income I will look forward to meeting you in person have a great one